Hello everybody, thank you so much for joining me today. So believe it or not, you guys, I have another Timu haul for you. Um, I do have a very large bag sitting here next to me. So we will see what we can get through with this bag. I'm sure there are tons of things in here. And then I do have another bag um, sitting here, but I'm excited to get everything out of here and um, see what I got. This bag has been sitting here for a couple of weeks. So let's get started and open this up. But before we begin, I just want to thank all my returning subscribers. Thank you so much for being here. And if you are a new subscriber, we want to welcome you. We're happy to have you. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel and you wanna see more Timu hauls, try on hauls, um, stitch fix videos, or just whatever I feel like doing, um, plant videos, um, then don't forget to subscribe before you leave. But let's get into this bag and see what I got. All right, so I cut into the bag and there is so much stuff in here. I'm just going to pull some, some of it out and put it here on my table um, because there is a lot of stuff in here. All right, so I have a huge pile sitting here in front of me and that bag is still stuffed so full. So let me get started because this is gonna be a very long video. All right, so the first thing is in this little bag and so this is a, when we were kids, we called these um, like cush balls or something. Um, they're just like a little different, you know, multicolored ball that you can um, play with, you can ca play catch and stuff like that. So I did get these for my boys. I believe I got two of them, but um, that is the first item. Next thing is a blind bag and you guys know me. I love these blind bags. Um, they're just really fun and I have all of my um, figures that I have got from blind bags before sitting here next to me. Um, so this one, so I will put the figures of what you can get um, from this blind bag up here so we can see who I got. Oh, it's so cute. So this is the one that I got. And that is the back of her. I like the flowers in her hair. She's so cute. And it comes with a little stand that you can um, put her on. And then it also comes with, it looks like a little flower that she can hold. Oh, it's not a flower, it's a little rabbit. And she just holds it, but I'm having trouble getting that in her hand, so I'll have to do that um, later. And then here is her car. Oh, her name is Joy, how cute is that? That's cute. All right, next I got another blind box and this one is called Emma. And these are the different ones that um, you can get. So it is in a blind box. It does have the card in the box. So I will not look at that until we see which one we got. Oh, how pretty. She's really pretty. She has pretty flowers on her bonnet. All right, next we have a little um, bag. So I got these for my nieces. I thought that um, for their birthday, I could um, just give these to them with maybe like some money in it or something, but that is the first one. It's just a little coin purse. So I got that one and I also, got um, another little coin purse for another one of my nieces. Um, I just thought it would be a cute idea for their birthdays. So, got that one. This one has a little chain on it and it's like a plushy material. I also got um, another one. This one is just a purple 
with flowers on it. And then it has some little beads um, on the zipper. They can put maybe like chapstick or um, their headphones or something in here. But got that one. And then what is this? So there's something in a clear bag. Oh, so I got some eyeshadow. I wanted to try this eyeshadow out. Um, not that I don't have enough eyeshadow, but I just wanted to give this one a try. I don't think it was very expensive, so um, I grabbed this one. And it is just a, like a white. So I do put um, like a light, really light color in the corner of my eye and I kind of like spread it to the center of my eye and, and this isn't very pigmented like at all but that is what it looks like it's kind of chalky like really powdery too so I don't even know if I'll get any use out of this but um, I will give it a try with some eyeshadow primer and see if that helps all right, next thing is a clothing item, and we know how it works here. If, if I get any clothes, I will try them on at the end of the video. And if you watched my last haul, this is the same tank top that I got in my last haul, but I just love these tank tops. They are so soft and comfortable. So I'm sure I have more somewhere in these hauls, because um, like I said, I'm trying to weed out my other tank tops and just get all the soft Timu tank tops. Next is in this bag and it feels like something. Oh yes, I remember. Okay, so I got this little sign to put at my desk at work. So it says one small positive thought in the morning can change your whole day. So, and it's, it's nice, I mean, it's wood and it's very well made. So that's a pretty good deal. So I'm gonna put that at my desk because at work, everybody comes over to my desk a million times a day asking me questions, asking me for help. So I figure that everybody in the office will see this because um, they will come to my desk at one time or another. All right, next is something else that I got from my boys. I just thought that this was something fun that they um, could do. So it comes with this little bird. And then it comes with this little like pyramid triangle thing. And I guess you're supposed to try to balance the bird on here somehow. I don't know, you're supposed to balance it on here. I will insert a picture um, here what it looks like when it balances, but this is something that my boys can um, try to figure out. So I do know that I got another one. I got um, one for each of my younger boys. And there is something in this box and it sounds, oh, okay. So I got this little light board. And so it comes with a little frame and then it does come with the um, little board and it feels like maybe plexiglass, but you, you peel this film off and then you um, stick it in here. It does come with markers so you can write on here. Um, this maybe even can be something that I take to um, work with me and write like a little positive saying or like an affirmation a positive affirmation on there Or I was thinking of putting it back here on my plant shelf, but we will have to see um, What I do, but then it lights up and it just um, I mean I'll insert a picture to show you what it looks like but um, I'm excited for this. I think I'm going to take it to work and write positive um, Little notes on it all right, next thing I got is some eyelashes. And you guys, I do not know how to put on false eyelashes to save my life, but I am going to try. 
Um, so I need to buy some eyelash glue and then I'm going to try to put these on. So these ones, I like them because they um, were more on the outer corners and less in the inner corners. And so I think that will be easier for me to wear, but um, we will have to see. They do feel very soft. So I will definitely give those a try. And if I figure out how to put these on, I will wear them in a video and show you guys. All right, so it looks like we have some clothing items. Okay, this next thing is a, um, like a shaper, shapewear. Um, Cause I did buy that other one that had like pads in it and I wasn't trying to wear that. So I got this one and we will see how I like this. Um, but it's supposed to control your um, like lower stomach as well. I've seen them where they only control like your waist and I need one that controls like lower stomach. So I got this shapewear and then this is what it looks like in the back. Next, I got some pillow covers. So I got this um, green pillow cover and it has white in the back. It's very soft, so it's not like the burlap type feeling ones. Um, this one's very soft like material, kind of like um, suede, kind of feels suede. And I'm going to put this on my bed for spring um, because I did get a very pretty um, duvet cover. Hopefully it's in this order because I've been wanting to put it on my bed, but I will probably put this on my bed with that. And next thing is another clothing item. And I believe this is a dress. So, yes, this is a black and white dress. Um, so it is sleeveless and it does have the cross in the front here. I haven't had so much luck with the crosses in the front. Um, I don't know, they seem very like big or baggy. Okay, sorry about that, my battery died. But I think I was um, talking about this dress. Um, so it is comes down to a pretty far length. Um, and it does look like it has like a cross um, over here in the front as well. So I will try this on and hopefully it fits in the top area because um, I haven't had much luck with these. So we'll see how that goes. All right, next up looks like some earrings, but I don't think I'm gonna put these earrings on because they don't look, I mean, they look like um, when you were a kid and you would wear those like bangle bracelets. So I don't know, I mean, I guess they would be fine, but um, I'm gonna hold these to the side. If I don't find any earrings um, here shortly, I'll just stick these ones on. All right, so next up we have another blind bag and this is, I think it's the same one. It's from the same one as, as this one. So hopefully we don't get this one and we get a different one. But once again, I will pop up a picture of the ones that we can um, get. Okay, so it looks like it's a different one. Oh, cute, it's a little pig. So, and this one has a little flower on its head. And then it does come with it looks like a friend. Yes, it comes with a little frog friend. How cute is that? And then it comes with a little star, maybe like an owl or something. So, and it looks like the frog is holding the owl. Maybe. Oh, 
Okay, so these are the ones that I got. That's so cute. Alright, I'm going to put them over here with the rest of my blind bag collection. Alright, so another little um, coin purse type thing for my nieces. So this is another one that I got. And they're not very expensive at all and I just thought that they would be um, something cute for them. So it just opens up like the snap closure. And I thought that one was really cute. The next thing is in this white bubble wrap bag. Okay, so I got one of these in my last, I think I think I won this on like farmland or fish land or whatever they are. Um, it is just a USB like charging thing. So I did get one of these in my last haul, in my last haul, and I'm already using it. So these are always good to have, and um, I'll see if my boys maybe need one. If not, I will just keep it because I know they do come in handy. Okay, so the next thing, I did get this card for my sister, and it is not her birthday. Her birthday was in January, but I thought it was so funny, and I'm going to send it to her. So let me open it up. She's gonna, she's gonna laugh. Like, and we live super close. Like, I'm only like 20 minutes from her, but I thought that she could have, you know, a good laugh when she gets her mail. So it says, I tried to send you something awesome, but the postman told me to get out of the mailbox. So she, I know she will laugh at this card. It's just blank inside. And, um, I'll probably put like a Starbucks gift card or something in there for her, but I know she's gonna love that. All right, and the next thing is another clothing item and it's really heavy. Um, looks like a pair of jeans. You guys know me with the jeans and they are a very dark wash jean and it looks like they have like side pockets. So maybe like a carpenter type pants. Um, so that's cute. I don't have anything like this. And then it does have like a little loop here. So it is like the carpenter um, type pants. And then of course they do taper down um, like the skinny jean or taper down um, at the ankle. And they do have pockets in the back. So I will try those on. Um, what size are they? So they are an XL, which is the size 12. And so those ones um, fit me very well. And then the last thing is a pair of scissors. So these are um, kitchen scissors. And I don't know if they were like on a lightning, lightning deal or just they're always that um, inexpensive, but they're really inexpensive. So I grabbed a pair because our kitchen scissors are always going missing. So I thought we would have a second pair. Um, they are just plastic handle. They seem very sharp. All right, so I'm gonna grab some more stuff out of this bag. If I don't find earrings, I'm just gonna stick those um, bracelet earrings on. But let me grab a whole bunch of stuff out of this bag. Okay, so I got a lot more stuff out of the bag and there's still a lot more in there. So um, next thing I got is a gel nail polish. And this one, I can't even read what it says, but um, it looks, oh, so it's like a green sparkly color. And I still haven't painted my toes, but I definitely need to do that. I will make time to do that either today or tomorrow um, because now I have everything that I need, so I have no excuses to paint my toes. All right, next thing is another one of the pillow, um, like the pillowcase, pillow covers. So I got two of them. Like I said, I want to put them on my bed. So got another one. And I also got this cute shirt. So if you watched my last Timu haul with my um, gold and my silver, like aluminum foil looking um, tank tops, 
I am just all about the sparkle lately and I saw this cute pink tank top and I had to get it. So it has all these sequins on it and not only is it on the front but it's also on the back. And it has a um, little button here and then inside it's very soft and silky so hopefully it doesn't um, you know scratch at all but I'm excited to try that on and hopefully it fits. Um, I'm not sure what I would wear it with but maybe like some white pants or even some like light blue jeans um, but I'm excited to try this shirt on. Oh, so this is another one of the um, like the shapewear and I just got um, a couple of different ones to see which one I like best. So this one is more of like a sheer, but it does also have the tummy control um, way down here at the bottom. And this one feels like it has like a ribbing or some kind of plastic in it. So I don't know how comfortable that will be, but I will have to try this on and let you guys know what I think about it. All right, next I got, so I, once again, I didn't pay attention and I ordered two of these shirts. So um, they are a like a denim um, sleeveless shirt with a collar. And I just loved the color of this. And these were, these weren't too expensive and they're very lightweight. So they will be awesome to wear in the summer and then they do have like a light brown button on here. Um, I mean, these you would probably have to wear with like, um, like a white pair of pants or, I don't know. I don't think you can wear this. Maybe, maybe a light pair of jeans. I don't know, I'll have to see. Um, but I thought that was a pretty color and I like the denim look of it. Got another blind bag. So the this is the same, um, blind bag as the little girl that I got and then the pig and the frog. So hopefully I got something different. Okay, I got a different one. So it is another little girl. How cute. She has little cherry blossoms in her hair. And she's holding maybe a mirror or a sucker or something. So that is so cute. And then her little, um, she comes with a little tree, like a, maybe a cherry blossom tree. And a bell. So it comes with this little tree and then this little bell accessory. So that is so cute. I'm glad that I got three different ones and Maybe I'll have to try to get all of them, but that's really cute. And I, I think I like this one. I think I like this one the best so far. All right, so I found another pair of earrings. These ones are like a nude or like a cream colored, khaki colored earring. And they have a gold. Um, let me see if I can put them on. We'll see what they look like. So I normally don't wear the earrings with the posts, so you guys will have to let me know what you think of these. Um, they are kind of heavy, but I think they are cute. All right, so I got another um, little bird. So this is for, like I said, I got two birds and then I got two of the like hacky sack cush balls or whatever you call them. So that is what these are. So I will give those to my boys and they um, will have to see if they can figure out how to use the bird, how to balance it on the pyramid. All right, next thing says, ojos, I don't know, it's in Spanish. Um, it's a makeup item and so it looks like it's a waterproof something. 
So it looks like it is a lip liner. But on the package, maybe it's saying for eyes and lips. I don't know, but it looks like a lip liner to me. But it's a pretty color. Um, this is type of color that I wear, so I will definitely try that out. I do have another one that I got from Timu. It's like a darker color and I really do like it. Um, I use it all the time. So I'm sure I will like this one just as well. All right, next up is another clothing item and I'm excited for this because I've never had um, something like this. So I'm excited to try it on. So this is, it looks like the same as the denim looking shirt that I got but it is like a romper type thing. And like I said, I've never had a romper or wore a romper. So I'm excited to try this on and see what it looks like. Um, it already looks like it's gonna be way too short for me. Um, I don't ever wear anything this short just because, like I said, I don't like my legs, but I will try it on. We'll see what it looks like. It does come with a, like a tie, like a belt. And I never know how to use these, but I will try this on and hopefully it looks cute and hopefully it's not too short um, because I really do want to wear a romper and I really did like this one. I liked the jean look of it, but it's a really light material. And then I got a tank top. So these ones are the ribbed kind. These aren't my favorite. Um, I don't think I will buy any more of these, but they do have the ruching on the side. Um, they are ribbed and they're not the softest feeling tank tops, but I do have a couple of them and I do wear them. And then I got a pair of shoes. So I hope that I got these in a seven and a half because um, I have purchased some of these shoes before and in an eight and they did not fit me. They were way too big for my feet. Um, so I did have to return them, but they are just a, I got red because I don't have any red shoes and they're pretty inexpensive. And I just thought that they were um, like a cute, simple shoe, black sole, um, like a knit material here on top. And I'm hoping that I got them in a seven and a half. Mm. I don't know, it doesn't say, but I will have to look at my order and um, hope that I got them in a seven and a half, but I will also try these on. All right, and then the last thing that I grabbed out before I have to reach in and grab out a whole bunch more stuff is another blind box. So this is the one, um, oh no, this is a different one. So this one has, these are the ones that you can get. And I think I want to get, I think I want this one here with the flowers. Oh, cool. <gasps> this is, is this the one I wanted? Let me find the other box. Um, this is the one with the headdress that I wanted from before. Oh, so it looks like they have um, the other ones on this side, but they have a sticker on it. So this is the one that I wanted in the last box, in the last one that I got, and I finally got it. It's so cute. Okay, so now my hunt is over. I'm sure that I have some more um, in some of these bags, but now my hunt is over and I got the one that I wanted. Um, that is so cute. So, I don't know if it's a dog or a rabbit, but it's cute. Okay, I'm gonna get some more stuff out of the bag for us to open, and it's nowhere near empty, so um, we are at 20... 23 minutes on this one and my battery died so I don't know how many minutes I had on that other 
um, one, but we are going to get through this today. And then I still have to try all these clothes on. So I hope that you guys have a drink or some a snack because this is going to be a long one. All right, so this is a like a um, potato peeler or vegetable peeler. And I got this free. It was, um, I don't know, on one of the games. It wasn't like a prize on one of the games, but it said like pick a, an item to ship before or whatever. I don't know. But I just picked a potato peeler because these always go missing in our kitchen. So I got a backup. And I mean, it seems very sturdy. So got that. Next thing is a little sign. Okay, so this is just um, another sign that says one small positive thought in the morning can change your whole day. So I will probably put this one near my vanity and I'll take the other one to work. So next thing is another clothing item and I think these are some shorts. Yes, these are a pair of shorts that I got. So these are the types of shorts that I like where they are long, they come down um, you know, to my knee. And so I got these black ones. They do have some distressing um, here on the thighs. They don't have any in the back, so that's good. But they do have pockets. And they are an extra large, so a size 12. And I think these will um, fit pretty good. They do have like a raw um, hem to them so I will see have to see how those look and another I got another clothing item oh this is a tank top so this is a black tank top and I don't know what it is they have these um, the ruching on the sides here so it's like a um, elastic on the side and I just like the regular tank tops that um, you know, are just straight like the first one I showed you, that red one. Um, but I will wear this. I just won't buy any more of these, but um, I will wear it. And then the next thing is another clothing item. And so this, okay, so this is the tank top that I'm talking about. They are um, just like a very soft material. They don't have any ruching on the sides. And... Um, this is what they look like. So I think I have um, gray, I have red, pink. I think I have a white one. And I really do like these tank tops. And I have another clothing item. I think this is actually a pajama set. Um, yes, it is. So it is just a little like peach color, white striped top. And then it has a pair of shorts to go with it. So it's very stretchy. I These are an extra large. And these are very comfortable to wear to bed. I do have another set of these. They're more like a spaghetti strap. But they're very comfortable. And now that it is getting warmer, um, these would be awesome to have for the summer to sleep in. And I got another pair of shoes. So I got the same as the red ones. I got a pair of black ones. And these are the ones that I had before, but um, I had to return them because they were a size eight and they were just um, way too big for me. But same thing, basic flat um, black shoe with a point. And I hope these fit because these are so easy to get on and off. And um, I think they're pretty cute. They just have like a knit top. And then I got a makeup item. So this is a lipstick. Honey glazed lip, shine lip color. Size, oh, I mean, um, shade 04. So that's a pretty color. I haven't had much luck with the Timu lipsticks, but I thought I'd give it another try. Today I am wearing the Ofra lipstick that I got in my um, boxy or my Ipsy. 
I will have to leave the color on the screen. I know somebody asked me about, um, about it before in one of my other hauls and um, I don't know what color it is so I will um, look at it and put it here on the screen. But I don't know about these Timu ones. They're not very pigmented and they don't stay very, last very long but um, I thought I'd give this one a try and see how that goes. And then two more signs here. So this one says, work hard and be nice to people. So it's just cardboard. I will have to find a frame to put it in, but this is, I'm gonna put this at my desk as well. And then I got another sign that says, always remember you matter, you belong here, you're doing great, you can do anything, I believe in you. Those will go to work. All right, we're almost to the end of this bag. Okay, so I got everything out of the bag and there aren't very many things left. So we will um, get through these and then I will try on the clothes that um, I got. So I got these lipsticks. There are six of them. And let's see, there are a few shades that I will wear. Some of them I just will not wear. I will just give these to my sister and she can, um, she can either use them or she can share them with her daughters. But I like this color. And I'm not, I don't like the, this one, it's like an orange. Um, and then I like this one as well, so. But these other ones I won't wear, so like I said, I'll just pass them along to her and she will appreciate that. So I'm gonna open up this big box. I'm curious to see what is in here. So it does have styrofoam here on the top. I'm just gonna cut the box open because I don't wanna slide the styrofoam out. Oh yes, okay. So I got this little hanging pot. It's a little pot on a swing uh, because I was watching April Rain's channel, Menopause and Madness, and she got this little pot and I was so excited to see it. So I grabbed one for myself. So I'm going to, you guys probably can't see, but I'm gonna hang it right up here. I do have a, like a big plate type um, plant holder up there right now, but it's just taking up too much of my grow light. So I'm gonna put this one up there instead. How cute is this? So it's just a little planter on a swing and it's, I mean, it's pretty sturdy. I don't know, it's some kind of, sturdy material, but I thought that was so cute. So now I'm gonna to have to figure out what plant I'm gonna put in here, but I just want to um, give a shout out to April Rain. Thank you so much for showing this on your channel because it is so cute and I'm so happy to have it. And I can't wait to hang it up and stick a plant in it. It does come with a little hook that you can put in your, um, your ceiling to hang it. And then it also comes with uh, this little hook here as well. So I guess you can hang it like that or you can just hang it with the hook, but I'm excited. That is so cute. All right, so I have two more blind boxes. So this is the first one and um, these are the different ones that you can get. And let's see, I want to get I think I have one of these. Yeah, I do. So I want to get the little girl with the cat ears. Oh, how cute. This one's reading a book. I should give this to my um, oldest sister. She's a librarian and she loves books. So maybe I'll give that to her. I think she would appreciate that. That's really cute. And then it also comes with a little park bench, it looks like. So it comes with this little bench um, and then another little book. So 
That is so cute. I'm gonna give that to my oldest sister and she can put it up on her bookshelf. All right, and then I have another blind box. So this one, I think this is the only one um, that I got of this one because I think these were sold out when I went back to get more. So let's see, I wanna get, I wanna get this little girl with the orange hat. Oh, this one's cute. So she looks like she's like something water of some sort. Let me get my glasses. I can't read what this says. I still can't see what it says, but I will. Oh, let's see what the card. The card doesn't say what it is either, but she's really cute. And like I said, when I went back to get more, I'm pretty sure that they were sold out of these. Um, but I will keep an eye out because these are really cute. Um, it does look like her legs do move. And she doesn't have any accessories with her. But she is a cute figure. Okay, so just a few more things in this... Um, bag and then I will open this other bag there's only um, one item in it but and then we will I will try the clothes on so this is a magnetic monthly planner that you can put on your refrigerator and I thought uh, it does come with some markers and I thought this would be good to stick on the refrigerator and um, put like what dinner is going to be um, so I know, my husband knows, and my kids know what dinner is going to be that night, and um, I can get the ingredients for it and just make things a lot simpler. So this is what it looks like. It's pretty heavy duty. It um, seems very sturdy, and then it's just a big magnet on the back, and then it does come with the markers, which have erasers on the tips of them. All right, and then the last thing in... Um, that bag is something that I've been waiting for you guys. I want to try this and I want to let you guys know um, How it is if you guys have tried the duvet covers from Timu, let me know what you think of them um, I was really excited to try this out. I thought it was such a pretty um, Fabric and this is what it looks like So I just got um, it's white with pretty flowers on it for spring and I don't know if those pillows will match it so well but I will have to see and it does come with um, two of the pillowcases and it has this like minty green color on the other side and then the pretty um, print on this side so I'm going to wash these today and I'm going to stick them on um, my bed. But I'm really excited for these and they seem very soft, very good quality. Not the softest thing I've ever felt, but they are pretty soft. They're not polyester filling, um, like sick, slick filling or anything like that. Um, so I'm excited. I'm excited to try these out, stick them on my bed. All right, now this bag is just one item and I'm going to try not to cut it. Okay, so this is what I got. It came in a, um, like a vacuum sealed bag. And I got four of the smaller throw pillows. So I want to get um, different pillow covers to go on these and I think they are, I'm not sure what size they are. I'll have to look in my order and put it up on the screen. But they are very um, full and they feel very nice. And I'm excited to get some cute pillow covers to go over these and either stick them on my bed or stick them here on my couch. But um, I don't think these were very expensive either for four of them. 
So, and they're, they seem very good quality. They do have a zipper and they just have the polyfill inside. So, I don't know, I'm excited for those. Now I can buy cute pillow covers on Timu um, to go on these for the different seasons. So I'm gonna have to find some for spring. Okay, you guys, so that is all that was in that huge bag. There was a lot of stuff in there, but I was really excited to get through it because I really wanted my duvet cover. Um, but I am going to try these clothes on. There aren't too many of them, um, but I'm gonna try them on and we will see how they fit and what they look like. And of course, you guys will have to let me know what you guys think of them, um, but let me start trying the clothes on. Okay, so here is the blue denim looking shirt. I like it. It's very comfortable. Um, I think it fits very nice and um, it doesn't seem like it's too big for me. Um, I do have it unbuttoned here. Um, I have had some comments that say that it looks better when it's unbuttoned um, and put like a tank top or something under it, um, but it's very comfortable. The pants are, um, they're cute. Um, they are not something that I normally wear, but I think they are, they're fine. Um, they do have the pockets here on the sides and then the little um, loop here on this side. And this is what they look like in the front. And then this is what they look like in the back. They do have pockets, so that is always a good thing. And the shoes are a little bit too big. Um, they are a seven and a half, but I will have to probably size down to a seven, but they're very comfortable and they're easy just to slip on. They do have so many different colors. Um, like I said, I got the red and the black, but they do have green. They have, I think they even had white, orange, just all different colors. So um, they're very convenient, very inexpensive and they fit, but I think that I can size down. Okay, so here is the pink sequin um, top, and I don't know, you guys, I had a different um, vision for this, but I think it's kind of giving me um, older than I am vibes. Um, I mean, it's cute, and I didn't, I didn't have it buttoned here because um, I couldn't get it buttoned, but this is what it looks like in the back. It is sequins all the way around. Um, but I don't know, you guys will have to let me know what you think. Um, is it making me look older than I am? Um, it is a little bit scratchy when I rub my arms on, on it, so I don't know about that. But I think it would look cute with a different color pants. But like I said, let me know what you guys think of the pink sequins top. Thumbs down, thumbs up, you guys will have to let me know. Okay, you guys, so here is the romper, and unfortunately, it's not going to work for me. I had really high hopes for it because I thought it was really cute, but I just don't think it's long enough, and it comes up um, too high up on my thigh, and I really don't like my legs. I never have, so there's no way that I would ever wear this, um, but I do like the concept of it, so I'm hoping that I can find something um, comparable to this because I really do think it's cute. You guys will have to let me know what you think of it. Um, I was even debating showing you guys what it looks like, but what do you guys think? So um, I do think the little tie here does add something to it and this is what it looks like in the back. So it just comes up way too high in the back. So this is something that I would never wear unless it was a little bit longer then I would totally wear it. But like I said, it's just um, too short. So let me try on the dress and um, we will see what that looks like. Hopefully it is not um, too loose in the top, um, but let's see what it looks like. Okay, here is the dress. And once again, it is just way too loose here um, in the top. I'm not sure why. Um, I guess I can maybe get like pin it over like this. But I'm not sure how that will look. Um, I think I'm just going to have to not buy the dresses with um, the crossover here in the front because they they just don't work for me. I'm not sure what it is. Um, just too much fabric here 
on, you know, in the in the chest area. But I do like this dress. I think it's cute. It does have the little um, slit here in the front, and then it does come down pretty long in the back, so that is nice. Um, I don't know. It's very loud. Um, so this is the type of material that my husband says you can't sneak up on sneak up on anybody um, because it is loud. You can it's it's the polyester material, but um, I think I'll have to return the dress. I'll have to return the romper and um, find something else. But I thought this dress was cute, but sadly it just doesn't work for me. Okay, you guys, so that was everything that I got in this Timu haul. I do have two big bags still sitting here, so stay tuned for more Timu hauls. If you missed my Stitch Fix try-on video and you want to see that, um, I will link it up above here and if you want to go take a look at it. But if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos from me and you have not yet subscribed, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. But I just want to thank everybody so much for watching. And until next time, guys, bye.